Hey guys, this is Morris from Illuminate Knowledge Base. You don't know me because I'm usually behind the camera, but today we have some good news. We have our own YouTube channel and we thought we'd take this opportunity to tell you a little bit about what we're going to have in the future for you and what the team behind the Knowledge Base looks like and what we do. Hi, my name is Daniel and my job at Illuvit is the innovation department. And so we have ideas, we do a lot of tests and investigation researches on it. And as soon as we prove a concept, uh, we pass it on to the development department and they make a product and do the industrialization phase and bring the product to the market. My name is Florian. I am the head of the Illuvit Academy. We build up training and also do some research work. So we not only publish knowledge on the knowledge base, we also provide practical trainings and hybrid trainings all over the world in the field of inspection and use of PPE. Hi, my name is Phil. I am the head of product here at Edelried. And that means I oversee our development teams that are ranging from ropes to shoes to apparel, all the other textiles, as well as the hardware development and the product management team. Initially, we realized for ourselves that we have a slightly different approach to product development. Maybe it's because of us as persons, maybe it's something German, but in most cases, we really think all the details through to the end and we really want to know. We also realized a lot of this knowledge we build up in the process can actually benefit others. Of course, those who use our product, but not only no matter if it is on the recreational side or on the professional side. On the knowledge base, we want to provide deep information on PPE to give the users the chance to learn about the boundaries of materials and products to handle the danger of the height consciously. Topics on the knowledge base have to be independent from certain product model and there has to be certain test or experiment involved. And important is that we are able to talk about the topic as objectively and neutral as possible. So what's important for us is that the content that we are creating for the knowledge base is independent from Edelrid products. It should be something that refers to product groups or as certain applications. Of course, uh, we don't make a secret about the fact that we are all employed here at Edelried. Nevertheless, uh, I think there is a way of presenting topics and, 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 and knowledge about those topics in a very independent way. I think every YouTube channel is biased for one or the other motive. Um, and the only thing that you can do is be open about it. And that's what we're trying to do. You will see a lot of Edelried products in our videos, but this is simply to the fact that in many cases we, we break the products or we have to modify them. And then in this case, we are at the source and can easily get this product. And on the other side, we want to be respectful towards our competitors and not to badmouth about other products or competitors. Most people that work here are super passionate about what they do. They want to understand every little detail of what they're doing and, and the consequences of it. Like, I mean, we also recently manifested in our mission statement that knowledge is the guiding principle of what we do here, of our work. You can expect from us to dive very, very deeply into certain topics. We can do all kinds of different prototypes and test the very tiniest variations. A big advantage here is that we have our own workshops here for hardware, for textiles, for all types of prototyping, um, which allows us to have special setups here in our test tower, in our test facilities, or also do special mock-ups that we tune or that we especially create only for the tests that we want to perform. If you have any special topics that interest you, let us know. Drop them in the comments and then, yeah, the only thing that you can do to support this, if you think that's a very good idea, is to subscribe to the channel uh, and spread the word.